Ruk Achtana, Saif Devlin and Chef. Today I wanted to talk to you about zines. Have you ever heard of a zine? A zine is basically a handmade or a homemade magazine. And they've been around for a very long time. You can write them about any subject whatsoever. Um, they're a bit similar to what a blog might be nowadays, but made out of paper. So I'm going to show you how to make a very simple one out of just one sheet of paper. And I'm going to give you some examples of the type of thing that you can do with a zine. So to make a really basic zine booklet, uh, you just need a sheet of paper. And you're going to fold it in half. In half again. And in half a third time. Okay, really simple. Then you're going to open it up. And just fold it in half again. And one side will be open and one will be closed. On the closed side, you're going to either tear along this line if you've folded a really nice seam, or you can snip along here just until you get to that middle point there and you're going to open it out again fold it in half lengthways like this and then you're going to turn it on its side and you're going to make it so that you push the two sides together you can see you kind of make a diamond shape in the middle push them together flatten it out and you have got a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight page booklet that doesn't need any staples or anything else. And you can start to put stuff in it. You can write or you can draw or you can do whatever you like. But you've got a great little pocket sized book to start with. So you can do things like cut words out of newspapers um, and try some blackout poetry. Blackout poetry is when you get an article or a page out of a book and you choose your favorite words within it and you black out the rest so that whatever you have left becomes a poem. Or you might like to write something about your feelings. This is one my daughter made about her feelings over the last little while. Or you might like to write a story this is one that um, my daughter also made uh, a story about a character she'd made up. Or this is one by the author Sarah Maria Griffin. It's all about chicken nuggets. So really you can see that this you can make a zine out of anything and on any subject whatsoever. So have a think about what you'd like to write about. Watch over the video again if you want to see the instructions for the blank zine. And get writing and drawing and creating. So when you have finished your zine and you've put in whatever ideas you have, maybe you've written about a musician you like, maybe you've written a story, maybe you've written a love letter to somebody, it can be anything. You open it back out, flat, and you can put it into a photocopier and you can make copies and you can send them to all your friends and family to read. And that's a, a really fun thing to do. And I know I love getting them in the mail. So I hope you have really good fun making your zines. Slonga